back in Plickers on your computer. I'll show you how to download the cards. You go to help and get Plickers cards. And I found this help is really helpful if for anything that you're like, how did she do that? Go to the help up there. It's really, really helpful. Help. <laughs> get Plickers cards and you just click on, I just did the standard set because I don't need 63 cards. Standard and it downloads all those pages and you can print them out. I think, I, I must have minimized them so they were smaller cards and I glued it to an index card and had them laminated. I know some people have taken them to Office Depot and gotten the harder lamination or you could just do paper and keep printing them out as they get ruined. So that is how you get the cards. I store my cards in my room. I got a pocket chart, like it's like a calculator pocket chart with all the numbers. And so it serves multiple purposes because each number, it's their iPad number for my iPad lab. And I'll show you when we make the class list, each kid ends up having their own number. So that's how the computer knows Sally Smith is number 17, so when Sally holds up 17, it tells me what kid is answering what question. And so it goes with, I print the list and use the Plicker list as my iPad number chart, so they always get the same iPad number. And these little pockets were numbered and came that way. And so the card goes in there, they know where to get it and where to take it out. Of course, you can always store it however you want. Mm -hmm.